Uh, we're here with Dave Pickles, the uh, victor for the Ward 3 local councillor. Congratulations, Thank uh, you. Dave. Uh, Thank you. Maybe you can tell us uh, what you plan to do for the next four years and how you see things improving for the city of Pickering. Well, I, I, I think things are going well in the city. We're seeing lots of uh, business being attracted to the city. We're seeing lots of jobs being attracted to the city. That will help with uh, business taxes and help uh, reduce the residential tax rate. There's a lot of planning issues. It's going to be very interesting. Uh, planning in the north, planning in Seton. It's going to be a big challenge. Uh, as far as what I'm planning to do, I tend to uh, continue uh, responding to residents' concerns, hearing from residents, and uh, and making the best decisions that I think are in the best interest of the residents in the city of Pickering. So when you were knocking at the doors this time around for this election, what was the uh, most important issue? Probably taxes, but taxes and what else would be most Well, I, I, I think people, uh, people did express a concern about taxes, but not solely taxes. They appreciate that uh, taxes pay for a lot of services in the city, uh, including parks and snow removal and and fire and a lot of important services. So I think people are more concerned about seeing a balance between city services and taxes than they were solely about keeping taxes low. They know that there's services they want to be provided. They're, they're interested in a quality of life. They're interested in a quality of service in Pickering. And they're looking for a balance between, between taxes and the services in the city. So I think people are generally happy with services in the city. Of course, everybody has a favorite pothole or a favorite park or something that needs to be addressed, and uh, and we try to address those. So, with a lot of your ward being the north of Pickering, and of course with Seaton going in and talks of an airport, can you discuss <laughs> some of that and where you might like to see that go? Well, I, I think there's always concern about an airport. I'm not sure there's any real talk about an airport coming. Uh, my impression is most people don't support an airport. I've been very clear in not supporting an airport. But I think people are concerned uh, that development in Pickering not take place like it has in other areas where it's been sprawl. I think people are looking for, for smart growth, they're looking for sustainable development, they're looking for a balance between environmental protection but well-rounded communities. So not just cookie cutter houses, they're looking for mixed use, they're looking for uh, jobs and employment and, and, uh, and recreational opportunities. And, and green spaces being part of the mix. I think people are looking for, for better, smarter planning than maybe we've seen in, seen in the past in, in other areas. Well, congratulations, Councillor, on your how many terms is it now? Uh, thanks, Dave. It's my fifth election, my, sixth, my, my fifth uh, successful election, and I was actually surprised to see in the endorsements in the Ajax Picker News Advertiser where they referred to me as long-serving councillor because that's the first I really thought about that. But it has been 13 years. I'm elected for another four, and I'm looking very forward. I, th I think we have a good council, and I think we're going to have a good four years. Congratulations, and thank you for all the good work you do for the city of Pickering. Thank you.